hi guys welcome to PC tips pro in this video today I'm gonna show you how you can create a contact us page in your Google sites and uh, creating a contact us page that means you can ask your website visitor to uh, enter uh, the information like name phone number email and some comments so let's proceed further further to show you to create the contact us page and guys if you have not subscribed my channel yet please go ahead and do subscribe the channel so I'm going to open the Google Chrome browser here and first in order to create the Google uh, contact us page in the Google site I will go ahead and uh, open the Google Forms and make sure the email to create the Google Forms and to create the Google sites would be the same that will be the better way you can use different emails but if you will use the same email that will be good for you for the future also because if you want to directly embed or if you want to inherit from the uh, from the uh, Google Drive then it will be helpful at that time if you will use the same email so here I am in the Google form and I have opened up different different I already have created different different contact information page here so I'm going to create a new one so I'm going to just select this uh, template which already create given by the Google and I will just go ahead and modify this template so instead of contact information I will give a unique name which is contact us and uh, PC tips pro right now what are the entries it already has is name email address phone number and the comments so I don't want the address so I'm going to just uh, remove I'm going to delete this address section so now I do have name email phone number and the comment and I think that is all I need to ask my website visitor to enter so once this will be done here you can see send option coming up so I will just go ahead and click on the send option right now there are several options coming up send via email or you can uh, copy the link and the third option coming up which is embed HTML so I will just copy this code and uh, I will open a notepad and paste the same code here and that is it you can also copy from here which is copied to the clipboard now once it's done I will next I will do one thing I will go and log in to the Google site where I am creating my website so this is Google site and if you see I'm going to use the same email from PC tips pro to create the Google site now here is the PC tips pro website I already have created and I already have uh, explained in previous videos how to create the contact us about us page so here in the contact us page uh, you can see I have several I have already created several pages which is services about us contact us and home so I will click on this contact us page and but you can see I have not uh, you know uh, I have not uh, created any form or anything uh, to accept the entries from the visitors so now I will do so here uh, on the body part I'm going to put that same contact form so that uh, a visitor can enter or they can you know fill the form so in order to embed that Google form I will just make a double click on the body part then you can see there are several options coming up I can either drive I can either inherit from drive and there is a one more option coming up left is embed so I will click on this embed option and uh, you can see it's uh, saying by URL or the code so I'm going to select the code okay so let's select the URL itself now I will just copy the same uh, code and I will paste in here ok it's HTML right so then after doing that I will click on this next option right 
then it will give you a preview that how your page will look like after inserting this and I will just simply go ahead and click on this insert option now once I click on this insert that Google form will come up here so I'm going to just I'm going to just drag it and move it to the center of the page and it's not coming up with all the options so let me customize this one okay let me just I'm just trying to bring all the options okay now it's showing the name email phone number but still not the comment and uh, submit section so I'm going to scroll down a little bit more here okay okay I got the comment section but still not the submit so I'm going to customize little bit more yeah now I got the submit button here right so let me do it little bit more so it's a totally up to you where you want to place this one so I'm going to just drag a little bit more and try to make it on the center I guess this is the center now right once you done with this customization thing at last you can see there is a publish button at the right top side if you want to see the preview you can see here review the changes and publish or then or simply just directly go ahead and click on this publish button right now once you click on publish button it will show you a preview here what changes you have made and how your website will look like and how your website was looking like before so it's a uh, uh, preparing that same preview here you can see in the draft it will show how your page will look like once you publish and it will show the current page also so now you can see also at the left side it's saying that what changes you have made so I will just simply go ahead and click on this publish button no more changes right and once I click on this publish button in order to see the published page I will go ahead and click on this view publish page now here I'm opening up the contact us page now you can see contact us PC tips flow I do have the same entries here which is name email phone number and the comments right now I'm going to show you the practically whether it's working or not so in the name I'm going to type my name which is Aditya and in email I'm going to just type xyz at gmail.com right or let's make it PC tips row which is not the right email I'm just showing a demo and in the phone I'm going to enter manual numbers and in the comment hi this is demo and after filling all the entries I will click on the submit button make sure guys the name and email these two parts are mandatory so you must need to enter those uh, I mean those two details after filling all details I will click on the submit button this response this entry will go to the same Google contact form you can see we have got one response here you can see my name email phone number and the same comment which I entered there so every time whenever your web website visitor will uh, submit the form the response will come up always here that means you can go log into your Google Forms you can open the responses and you can see how much responses you have got so this is all guys this is the easiest way to create the simple contact form in your Google sites if you have any query you can uh, write in the comment and I will be there to answer there and thank you so much for watching the video and please guys don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you